for my entire career here at McNeese, that's over 35 years, I told you I would never see something like this happen at McNeese. Got a short notice. Thank you for coming out. I want to get started by bringing up our director of athletics, Heath Schroyer, and then he will bring up head coach Will Wade. Hello, everybody. Um, what a great day. Um, it is, uh, it's an honor to, uh, to announce this new contract um, today for Coach Wade. A year ago, a little over a year ago, um, when Coach and I were sitting down and, um, to solidify him as uh, our new basketball coach, I made him a promise. I said to him, I said, once this program gets flipped and we become relevant in men's basketball, I promise you I will rip up your contract and I will give you a new contract. Well, today's that day. What coach and his program has done for this university, for obviously our athletic department, and for this community uh, is nothing short than transformational. Under Coach Wade's leadership, this program has become nationally relevant. No question about it. The McNeese brand is now stronger and more recognizable, not only regionally, but nationally. I've always believed as a leader you have two options. You can either be reactive or you can be proactive. And I've always tried to be proactive. I've always said that this program, this university, this athletic department can accomplish things that it's never accomplished before. We can do things that's never been done before. And I think right now with Coach Wade leading this basketball program, you're starting to see that vision come to fruition. I couldn't be happier today. I couldn't be more excited about where we are and about where we're headed. And I'm really, really excited to, uh, to lock Coach up and get this done today. So without further ado, Coach Wade. For better or worse, I get the credit or I get the blame. But you know, it takes a lot of people to make this program work. All right, it's not, it's not me. All right, we've got phenomenal staff, and almost all of my staff's here. Like, it doesn't work without them. We've got tremendous players. Um, the players make it happen. I mean, I, I, I can only do so much. You don't want me shooting, I promise you. <laughs> I want to thank everybody in Southwest Louisiana. You've welcomed our, com our, our, our family to this community. My wife and daughter are here. Um, absolutely love it. My wife loves her school. Everybody's been so welcoming to us, and you know we're we're proud that we're able to hopefully give a little bit of joy back to everybody through our basketball program and, and through how our guys play and through how we interact uh, in the community. So when when Heath and I met the first time, we did it all on a handshake, <coughs> got up from the table and we shook hands and said, "All right, this is, this is what we're going to do." How I like to, that's how I like to roll and um, Heath and the administration have lived up to everything they said and hopefully we've lived up to what, that, uh, what we said that we would do. But the day after we beat Michigan, and so a lot of you guys here were in, at the Michigan game, we had 6,000 unique views on our website that we never had before. We had 600 of the 6,000 clicked on admissions and application. If we can just convert a few of those, that helps change our university, that helps change enrollment, that helps, I mean, that helps change everything. All through one basketball game, we're not even talking about winning a conference championship. And, uh, I'm very, very proud and humbled to be the coach here. I appreciate uh, everybody in this room's support. We couldn't do it without everybody in here. Like, I mean, it takes, it takes a, an army of people to do it. My wife and daughters are putting up with me at home. And, uh, you know, everybody in here who generously supports our program, uh, our players, staff, just just everybody. It, it makes a huge, huge difference. And I just want everybody to know we're, we're with you. We're fighting for you every day. And we're going to keep this thing rolling. we got a huge game on Saturday. So hopefully everybody will be back in the collective room Saturday before the game and, and be ready to rock and roll. But uh, I'm excited to continue the journey. My family is excited to continue the journey. And, uh, to, uh, we look forward to what's coming. The best is yet to come. Go Pokes!